Paris Hilton might just be the most well-known heiress there ever was, and she managed to take the status she was born with and transform it into her own empire. That also includes all of her impressive real estate. Between the Hollywood party pad she loved for years, her multi-million dollar home in Beverly Hills, complete with a mansion for her dogs and more, Paris has lived in some gorgeous houses. Paris Whitney Hilton is a famous socialite reality TV star, actress, singer, businesswoman, fashion designer, DJ, and more. Yes, it helps that she's an heiress and her great grandfather was the founder of Hilton Hotels, but at the end of the day, she did all the rest on her own. Just a warning, I might be a bit biased on this vid because I've loved Paris since day one. But whatever, we all have our faves. At the time of this recording, Paris is 38 years old but looks way younger, and I wish I knew what her secret was. Although she was just a famous party girl, the world probably wasn't prepared for everything Paris would do. She was in the five successful seasons of The Simple Life, her book, her acting ventures, her album Paris, and so much more. Not to mention, she's a successful international DJ and was the highest paid female DJ in 2014. Paris is credited with a lot of the famous for being famous thing that took over the world in the 2000s, and still heavily exists now. Even before social media, she was an original influencer, and may have even invented the selfie. Paris did, after all, introduce us to Kim K. Paris has amassed quite a fortune over her career. She used her fame to help launch successful business ventures, including her perfume brand, her stores, and plenty of other product lines, even a beach club resort. That being said, Paris earns over 10 mil a year from business ventures alone, and her estimated net worth is 300 million. She's really done it all, but today we're focusing less on these things and more on where Miss Hilton lives. Hey guys, it's Kara, and today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. I got some requests from you guys to report on where Paris Hilton calls home, and I was more than happy to. Today we'll look at her Beverly Hills estate, complete with a mansion for all her dogs and more. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post so you can always be up to date. We've also done house tours on the likes of Britney Spears and JLo, and we'll have links to those at the end of this. Follow me on Instagram because I love connecting with you guys and getting to know you. I've also been reading all your comments and I'm going to be responding to some at the end of this. I need you to let me know who to do next in the comments down below and whose home you'd like to see. Now let's get into this video. First of all, I don't even need to get into Paris' childhood home because you already know her and her fam lived in a gorgeous one. She was born in New York City and was raised there as well as Beverly Hills. In her early 20s, Paris purchased her first home in the Hollywood Hills, which became known as her party pad. She bought the Spanish style mansion in 2003 for around 1.5 million and decorated the interior in a Hollywood Regency style. Since Paris was the it girl in the early 2000s, you already know her parties were notorious too, and this is where they were hosted. This house in the exclusive neighborhood of the Hollywood Hills is 3,064 square feet with 4 beds and 3.5 baths. The master suite in this place is decked out with mirrored walls on all four sides of the room for unlimited selfies and making sure you looked great before you leave the house. I'm into it. Other features include full guest quarters, a wood paneled media room, and an extra entertaining room. The four bathrooms are luxury hotel standard, but can you expect anything less from a Hilton? Paris also had a gorgeous billiards room here, a home movie theater with velvet chairs, and what was maybe the coolest part, the basement. Here she designed a secret entertaining desk and just for parties, complete with a stripper bowl. The kitchen with all of the state-of-the-art appliances leads you to the spacious outdoor area. Here you'll find the landscape garden complete with a pool, spa, cabanas, fire pit, and additional yard space. Paris sold her Hollywood Hills pad fully furnished back in 2007 and left all the glam decor behind. Even the enormous signed portrait of Paris herself is still there. The current owner rents out the place for the most part and kept the whole celebrity inspired vibe. I guess it's working since it costs 30k or more per month to rent this house. And the last time it was up on the market, the asking price was at almost 5 million. Paris also purchased a fancy penthouse in her other hometown of New York City. In 2015, she signed off for a $4.9 million place in the Astor Place building. This beautiful penthouse is located in the heart of Manhattan and spans 2,396 square feet of living space, two beds, and two baths. 
The historical building was a warehouse when it was built in 1867, but since has had a complete remodel by Carl Fisher and Andre Escobar. Paris's unit is described as a rare and impressive full floor loft condominium. Her master bedroom has natural hardwood floors, plenty of space, a platform bed, and an additional lounge area. The ensuite bathroom offers a walk in shower plus a jacuzzi tub, perfect for relaxing. Some other features of Paris's New York penthouse include the large kitchen, a dining room overlooking the city, bright living room with a white marble fireplace, as well as ceiling lights just under 12 feet. Not to mention the huge windows showcasing the view. Paris also has an elevator that opens directly into the entryway of the home. Paris had trouble finding a place in NYC that was suitable for her and her seven or more dogs, but this place turned out to be perfect. It has a 905 square foot private rooftop terrace that overlooks Manhattan's NoHo neighborhood for the dogs to run around on. Not to mention this place is just steps away from Washington Square Park. Of course, Miss Hilton also has a main house in Beverly Hills. Considering she got rid of her Hollywood Hills pad, she needed a place to call home in LA. So let's take a look. Paris purchased her dream home in 2007, shortly after selling her previous one, and this one was a definite upgrade. Her mansion is located in the gated community of Mulholland Estates, an area of Beverly Hills which is no doubt full of celebs. Her neighbors include the likes of Kendall Jenner, Christina Aguilera, and more. Paris bought this home for $5.9 million, but she got it for almost a million less than the original asking price. Paris's Mediterranean-style mansion was built in 1991 and spans almost 7,000 square feet, more than double the size of her old place. It sits on almost an acre of land and has five beds and five and a half baths. There's a gorgeous two-story entryway and a winding staircase where Paris often poses and shows off her outfits via Instagram. Other features of her mansion include living rooms, a large family room with wet bar, office, a gourmet kitchen and breakfast room, butler's pantry, wine closet, and more. It also came complete with a full gym, but word was that Paris transformed that into a shoe closet instead. Her master suite has a glamorous ensuite attached as well as a private balcony with city views. And Paris modified the home to fit two decked out closets the size of an apartment or bigger. Not to mention a dressing room attached to the master bath. Paris has said that her favorite room in the house is her screening room. She said in an interview that it's her fave because, I love the color scheme, baby blue, pink, and gold. I built one of those hidden escape doors that looks like a bookshelf. It leads to a huge showroom for all my products. It's kind of like a secret office. This space has a French Victorian vibe like a lot of Paris's home, as well as a massive 120 inch screen where she likes to watch football games. There's also a carnival inspired photo booth, a ton of frame magazine covers with Paris on the walls, and a pink pool table. She also likes to pre-party and meet with friends in this room before they move on to Club Paris. Yes, Paris has her very own nightclub upstairs with a Bose sound system, smoke machines, a dance pole, and DJ booth. The stairway entrance to her club is located in the screening room. Despite the fact that her mansion has additional privacy and is in a secluded and gated community with a 24-hour guard, Paris has experienced more than one traumatic break-in over the years. The break-ins where robbers made off with about two mil worth of jewelry, purses, and clothes actually inspired the movie The Bling Ring. The inside of her actual Beverly Hills home was featured in parts of the film and featured a cameo of Paris herself. Moving outside onto the grounds of Paris' dream home, you'll find a gorgeous pool and spa with an attached grotto. But my personal favorite thing outside her house is a mansion she created just for her dogs. Paris is a dog lover just like myself. At the moment, I believe she has five or more fur babies and there have been times where she's owned more than eight. If I was her, I would also build a lavish custom mansion for them too. They deserve it. In 2009, Paris purchased this doggy mansion and paid 325 k for it, more than some human houses. It's 300 square feet of living space and the entire house has built-in air conditioning controlled from the outside to protect the dogs from the LA heat. There's also heating of course for when it cools down. Her dog's mansion is Spanish colonial style and is two floors. The second floor has a balcony where the pups can catch a beautiful view. Inside there are bright pink walls, a black wrought iron railings, and even a chandelier. Day beds, bean bags, and dog beds are around the house for the pups to relax on. The doggy mansion has its own perfect fenced in turf lawn and the large front door welcomes you with a gold fire hydrant. Personally, I'm obsessed with the dog mansion. Can my fellow dog owners agree? What was your favorite part of Paris's Beverly Hills dream home? Now we've seen Paris's former Hollywood Hills party pad, her New York penthouse, and her Beverly Hills estate she currently lives at. Which was your fave? 
I like her current home the best. Although she has experienced some unfortunate break-ins, she isn't hostile about it because they're just material possessions. She spent years making this mansion a home, and it doesn't seem like she's moving out anytime soon. I love how Paris puts her unique brand and personality into anywhere she chooses to live. Okay guys, I'm gonna read a few comments from our previous videos. Justin Johnson said on our recent JLo house tour, that was so dope, JLo's properties are amazing. I think the same Justin, I really love her Bel Air house. And on our Britney Spears house tour, Caesar said, this was so respectful and well done and you use current videos where she looks great unlike other media outlets who still try to portray her as crazy and irrelevant, which she isn't. She's an icon with great taste in her properties. Thanks Caesar, I couldn't agree more. I hate the Britney bashers because she's amazing and she does have great taste. I also got a request from Kathy Jamerson for a house tour of Sierra and Russell, so I'll add that to my list. Alright guys, that's all I could find on Paris Hilton's gorgeous homes and her main mansion in Beverly Hills. What did you guys think about her real estates? Let me know in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat more and I'll see you next time in the next video. Bye!